Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will show you how to create Absolute World in Revit, also called Marilyn Monroe Tower, located in Ontario, Canada. Let's get started. So I open a new architecture template. Let's go to South Elevation. Let's add levels. So click level two, click array, and then put in 27. Click this level and then maintain 4,000. So now we have a total of 28 levels. Click view, plan view, and then floor plan. And then we want to show all of this level in the floor plan here on our browser. So level three is already selected. Hold shift and then click level 28 and then press OK. So now let's go back to level one. Go to massing inside, click in place mass, and then press OK. Click Eclipse, click in the middle, so I'm just estimating the size and then press escape so we have our shape click that and then copy to clipboard paste and then align to selected levels so we're going to copy that on levels 4 8 so once you're selecting the levels just hold control 12, 16, 20, 24, and then 28. And then press OK. So now we have level 1. Let's go to level 4. Click the shape. And then we're going to rotate this every 30 degrees go to level 8 click the shape and then rotate this will be 60 level 12 click the shape and then click the rotate button then 90, click level 16, click the shape, and then rotate, 120, click level 20, click the shape, and then click rotate 150 level 24 will be 180 and then level 28 click the shape and then rotate that will be 21 so that will be 180, 150 here. Now that we're done, you can click 3D view. So now select everything and then click create form. 
so it will look like this now we could click finish mask and then select the mask let's add massing floors so click mask floor select level one scroll down and then hold shift and select up to level 28 release shift and then click on the box it will check everything and then press ok so all of our mass massing floors are now created we need to go to massing inside click the floor and then select everything again this will create the actual floor we could change how much the millimeters of the floor so you could edit the type you need to duplicate that first that's the original I'm just gonna put 100 millimeters thickness and then change this as well so now this is selected we can now create floor go back to massing inside click the roof select the face of the roof and then create floor and then lastly let's select the face go to massing inside and click curtain system select this right side face and then click create system and click the left side face and then click create system again you can then add mullions and then add mullions on the other side as well So once that's done, press escape and there your that's your model. Thank you for watching and I hope you liked the video. Please hit like and subscribe. Feel free to comment down below.